Hey guys, say hello to the birds. There's Pie the Magpie. There's Maple the Crow. And over here we got Peach and Cherry. And there's the new little birdie, Spice. Hello, Spice. Hey guys, it's Dennis here. And there's Kulika. Hi. <laughs> She's visiting with Pie and Maple. Hi. Yeah, we're enjoying our vacation here. And we brought our birds with us. That's right, we didn't want to leave them at home. We had someone that would have looked after them, but we would have missed them. And, and since Spice was, was just a little baby magpie, and he's, he or she's getting bigger now, but we thought we'd just bring them all. So cool, look how the viewers are probably wondering, why are Pie and Maple out of the cage and those other three guys are in their cages? Well, the Maple and Pie are very manageable, so you know, they usually stay right where you put them. Yeah. And, uh, well, Cherry doesn't want to come out of the cage, so you really have to convince her, him. You actually have to take him out. <laughs> so he doesn't want to come. There's but Peach, Peach, uh, Peach would come out, but Peach is a kind of un unpredictable little bit because he's an excellent flyer and he would uh, uh, likely go for a little flight, which would be fine, but except for this isn't really our home and no. we don't know what's here. It's not really bird proof. And uh, they have some ledge up there that. Uh, it's full of uh, some antique bottles and stuff. And I'll I show you that in that, a minute, guys. I just have the fear that he would go and fly there and all these bottles would crash and uh, break and fall and down. And it could so. fall on him or something. And yeah, we don't know really what's up there. Yeah, and, uh, yeah. And what about the little... What about Spice here? And little Spice is a... Uh, he's a kind of... Or she is uh, learning to fly and he's a kind of flying, but then he's very clumsy and he's crashing into things steady. So yep. uh, we don't want him to get hurt, so we don't know what he would fly in. <laughs> Actually, into. Spice is pulling on that curtain there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we don't want that to continue. He's a little hooligan yep. and a bird, so he... Uh, yeah, we don't know what he will be doing, and he will be crushing into things. So, so that's why these... Fly. Yeah, that's why these three are in the cages, guys. Because Cherry wouldn't come out, and, and if this is not a bird-proof home, it's not our home, it's a vacation home. Check the top of that out. Like It's just a huge like wall with a... The top part with a whole bunch of things up there. We don't even know what's up there. There's old bottles and... It looks like there's a collection of uh, old antique bottles. So if a beach would go and land onto those, then they would all fall down and uh, and probably break. So it won't be a good situation. So we don't want that no, to happen. We, we don't want to take a chance. That's what we're saying. We'd let them out. But if we were at home, we'll let them out. But this isn't our home and we don't know what's up there. So that's why. Yeah, so there's the pup, guys. Say hello, Cassie. Say hello to everyone. <laughs> Yeah, she's having a great time here. Let's go look at the birds again. There's little pie. He was talking earlier. Maybe yeah, he'll start talking. again. Just before we brought them here, but now it's a change in the environment. And, uh, Hello, pie. He stopped talking. Good pie. <laughs> good pie. Good pie. Yes. Yeah. He just said good peach and good pie. Good peach and good bird. There's little spice, guys. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Peach picked the name, so hopefully you guys like it. Like, there's other names that I liked more, but we got to go with what Peach picked. I think Spice is okay, though, like salt and pepper. Yeah, Spice is okay. And there's Cherry. Cherry would be... If Cherry wouldn't have come on holidays, he would have been miserable at home there, kind. He would have missed all his buddies here. So as much as Cherry doesn't want to come out of there... He's having fun on holidays with the rest of the gang. Yeah, he would still enjoy being with other birds. Yeah. And there's little Maple. <laughs> Hello, Maple. You're enjoying your holidays? <laughs> yeah, you're glad to be on vacation, too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're so happy to have the birds with us, too. <laughs> That's right, Peach. Yeah, if we would have left them home, we'd steady be talking about them. what are they doing and how are they feeling. Down. Yeah, we had someone that would have looked after them, but uh, we thought we'll bring them because we'd miss them. Now the birds are going to get a little tasty snack. Pie loves mealworms. Oh, yeah. That's one of his favorites. They all like mealworms, but Pie really likes mealworms and berries. Maple. Yeah, Maple's having one. Mm -hmm. Maple's got a very good appetite. Yeah, just like me. <laughs> Maple and I like to eat. 
<laughs> oh, look at that pie. That's cute. He, he, he wants a, a worm. Yeah, you'll get one pie. Can you find one? <laughs> yeah, good. Look at that. <laughs> the other ones are looking. Yeah, the other ones are, are waiting too. They're looking over there. You need another container, Kula? Yeah, I thought I brought. Left I thought I brought you the one. Okay, I'll go get it. I brought another container. <laughs> mm -hmm. Try that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we have some containers that have just a couple in them. <laughs> that one's a good fresh one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the other ones are looking. Yeah, you guys are gonna get some too. Just hang on. You get some worms. They really like cat food too. Mm -hmm. That's some wet cat food. Especially pie. Yeah, on, on holidays they're getting all the goodies. <laughs> yeah, it's time for the other gang to have some. Little Spice loves worms too. These magpies like mealworms. I mean, all the birds do though. He really likes that canned food. And he's eating canned food? Oh, okay. You're going to give him a mealworm or you don't give him? Uh, I have to put it in his mouth. He doesn't really recognize it as food, but he really likes that. Oh, okay. I thought you were giving him mealworms. Okay, let's see. <laughs> I didn't know. <laughs> I thought you've been I thought you'd been giving him. <laughs> he doesn't uh, No, he's taking it. Oh, look at this. He's working on it. He ate it. Okay. Yeah, he likes it. He likes cat food too, yeah. Ha! <laughs> now he's going to town, yeah. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah, he likes them. Yeah, we're having fun with the birds on holidays. We enjoyed their company so much because we spent a lot of time with them back home. Mm -hmm. So we would have really missed them. Peach and Cherry are waiting. Mm -hmm. The two big boys up there. And these two are pretty content. Pie and Maple. Okay, try Peach and Cherry, yeah. Really enjoying the vacation home, like I said. It's way bigger than a hotel room would be. <laughs> it's just huge, this place. Okay, Peach. Peach, Peach. Dig in, Peach. <laughs> yeah. Cherry, you're gonna get some. Yep. Try cherry out, Gulika. Mm -hmm. Cherry, get ready. <laughs> get ready, Cherry. <laughs> Peach is going <laughs> to take it. Cherry. Take it, Cherry, yeah. Good you gobbled it down, good yeah. Bird. Good, good. <laughs> yeah, they all had good snacks. Kulika, some of the viewers have been asking, how was that other magpie that we, we took to the wildlife rehab and... How's that bird doing? Oh, Jan said that magpie is doing great. Like she, she thought last time I talked to her, she said she said she might have even been released, or if not yet, then uh, she will be released any time. Because he was uh, like really, really <coughs> flying. Yeah, he's doing like, good. Yeah, she was a little bit older. Yeah. Or he, whatever <laughs> <what> it was. <laughs> and what about that other bird that we rescued in the backyard, and then you took that to Jan's? That uh, one, like first time when I called, because uh, they said the first night would be most critical. So when I called next uh, next day, I was really I was even scared to call because I thought, what if he had some internal injury or something? But he uh, he he was doing good next day. So they said he was even opening his beak and. Uh, and actually begging for food, so that was a very good sign. But and just before yeah, coming on a yeah. trip here, I called again, and again I was, I was worried. 
what is, but they they said that his his eyes had already opened and he's really yeah. doing good. He's getting way he better. Got, yeah. I was so relieved to hear that. So. Great. So they they really thought that at that point he was completely out of danger. So he was gonna make it. So. Right on. That was very good news. <laughs> I'm so happy about that. Actually, the nest box that that baby sparrow fell out of, there's no activity in there at all. There's like there's no parents going in there. There's no chicks chirping. Yeah, absolutely. Nothing. No. So, so who knows what happened there? Like, I, we we can only speculate, but there was no activity in that nest box. So like who knows? So guys, we just wanted to show you our birds here on vacation and how we interact with them and everything. And we're having a great vacation. So thanks for watching. And if you're new here, like always, please subscribe to our channel. I'm sure there's something up there you can find. And also click the notification bell, it's very important. So you're notified when we get videos out. So we'll see you in the next one, guys.